The Luo alphabet, also known as the Luo Lakeside script, was invented by Kefa Ambewa and Paul Sidandi between 2009 and 2012 to write Luo languages, specifically Doluo of Kenya, in a unique way. The script is a left-to-right alphabet with 33 letters connected to each other by a line running along the bottom. Topic letters topic The sounds below have been adopted by Luo speakers due to modern influence. Topic example topic The writing above says Uak Agwal Ok Mon Dhok Madho in Luo, translated as The croak of a frog doesn't prevent cattle from watering. Topic numbers topic The Luo system has its own symbols for numbers. These numbers range from 0 to 9 for mathematical use but large number representations are also available for colloquial use. The table below shows these numerals compared to Arabic Western numerals. Topic vowel diacritics topic In this alphabet, there are five vowels represented by the same stroke. The difference is in the diacritic added to the vowel stroke. These diacritics do not show vowel stress, tone or length as can be in other languages or writing systems. Luo is a tonal language i.e. the same written word said in a different tone can mean a different thing. These tones vary within vowels but are never written thereby making it important to get the right context of the word. The table below shows the vowels, notice the different diacritics applied on the same stroke. Topic punctuation and symbolo I topic Different systems have traditionally used different punctuation marks. Some did not even have any punctuation at all. In the Luo system commas, full stops, slash, colon, semicolon, question marks, brackets, hyphens, etc. are borrowed from the Latin system and are used in the same way. Mathematical or scientific symbols are also borrowed from the Latin system in the Western world. These symbols include dollar, percent, at, and, plus, equals, etc. Topic history topic The need to write Luo in a different script other than the Latin script has always been there since the introduction of the English alphabet by colonialists. However, there has not been a good reason why none was developed earlier. Other African writing systems have been developed before and some are still in use today. Work on the Luo alphabet started in 2009 by Kefa Ambewa. At the same time Paul Sidandi started his work on Luo numerals independently. The two men met on Twitter in 2013 and decided to combine the alphabet and the numerals to be a single project and the font produced was named Kefasidandi font. Digitization of the work started with a lot of challenges. Initially only a bitmap font was available. Thereafter in order to produce the true type font internet usage, will were joined to produce the font glyphs. The work was completed on June 12, 2012 when the first true type font was produced. This led to the ability to embed the script on the Luo Alphabet website and made the font downloadable for other interested users. The Luo Alphabet first came into the limelight in Kenya when Kefa Ambewa conducted an interview with Kenya Television Network in 2014. Topic. External links Topic. Luo Alphabet Interview with Kefa Ambewa Omniglot